Hello everybody, my name is Annabelle, and today we're doing something that probably someone's done before, but something that we haven't done before on this channel. So, we're gonna be carving apple pears. I don't know how I feel about it, but we're carving it because they're big. We're gonna open up this. These look nice, I guess. Flat side, oh, these, this one rolls, no. Okay, this one's better. This one. Ooh, this one. This one looks pretty nice. See how it works. Oh yeah, this is the one. First, I'm gonna get this Crayola marker. Write down the face I want to carve. I'm gonna go with a confused face because, like, why? Why am I being carved on an apple pear? Why not a pumpkin? And what even is an apple pear? Help. First, we're going to put down the face. So this is what our face is gonna be. We are going to cut the head off and then take out the insides, like, like what you do with a pumpkin. Oh boy, this might take a while. Very apple-y and pear-y, almost. Now we're gonna use this spoon right here to scoop out the insides. It smells really nice. Like, like an apple and a pear. We're gonna use these cutie little knives. Wow, these work surprisingly well. An apple pear seed. The menace. Ew! You know, this actually might be from my fingers. Yeah, it's from the marker on my hands. All right, real quick test here. The top still fits. Yeah! You know, the surprising and kind of bad thing here is it kind of does smell like a pumpkin. We're practically done. Let me just get rid of the bottom parts. Okay, so I just kind of rinsed out the inside and look, beautiful. So when I rinsed it off, I kind of killed the face. So we're gonna have to do that over again. Never mind, I don't like it anymore. I, I don't like it as much now, but that's okay. You know, three years ago when we first started this channel, we were expecting to do a whole bunch of Beanie Boo stuff. Have a lot of fun, didn't really expect to get 500 subscribers. Thank you, by the way, once again, thank you so much. But I never knew that doing this channel would lead to me making apple pumpkin. Hey, look, it looks pretty nice. I think this turned out pretty well. I don't think I can put a candle in it because, you know, it's too small to put a candle in it. So if you want to make this, I would suggest getting apple pears because they're way bigger. So they're gonna be easier to carve without messing something up. I would also probably suggest using a marker that won't wash off too easily or blur. 
because then it kind of messes up the face here as you can see and I would also definitely suggest use tiny knives so then you can cut better using big knives will definitely ruin this so um thank you for watching I hope you liked it please um like the video subscribe if you want to subscribe um dislike if you don't like it like it if you like it uh yeah